Hello, today we're going to go over the difference between cutting and trimming versus using Boolean operations to split objects. Here I have two shapes, a sphere and a set of lofted curves. In order to see what's going on, I'm going to turn some clipping planes on. So let me draw a clipping plane. I'll pull this up so we can see it. And I'll draw another one. And I'll make this vertical this time. OK. So I've cut my object in two ways. Uh, now let's take a quick look at what happens when we use trim and split. Uh, so we're under solid tools for right now. So when we use trim, for example, uh, what's going to happen is we're going to select the object to cut. And notice it's a solid right now. And we're going to select our cutting object. Oh, I got that backwards. Uh, trim uses cutting first, and then the, the object to cut. Uh, so when you use trim, select your cutting objects. And then you have to select the area that you want to remove to cut out. So here, for example, what we're seeing is my sphere is still a solid, but my shape has now become a polysurface, where it has a bottom, a, top, a sides, and a top. Let's back up two seconds. So we can see this with uh, splitting as well. So if we use split, objects to split are here. And our cutting objects are here. Here we can see, if we pull this out, that this part was removed. OK, so let's back up one more time as a solid. So cutting and splitting uh, doesn't maintain properties of a solid. But we have solid tool operations which do. Uh, let's take a look at how these work. Uh, so let's show you here. When we use solid, uh, Boolean union, it's going to join two objects together to make them single. And notice how uh, my sphere has changed layers to the first object I selected. So if we want to reverse that, the other would be true. So there's an order of operations that's important. Let's look at difference. So Boolean difference is a way of subtracting a solid from a solid and still remaining, still allowing a solid uh, to remain as such. Okay, so this time let's subtract with our sphere. And then as soon as we hide this, we can see it's still maintained as a solid shape. Let's turn it back on. OK. So um, you can play around again with the split here. Um, and then just to sort of walk you through Boolean two objects, if I right click on there, Um, then I can iterate through the different. So here's union and so forth. And it's changing to my current layer. Uh, so there's all the, he, these go through all the possibilities of the intersection. Um, if you want to do the intersection here, it will just take only the part which remains. So just to, in order to see that, let's disable clipping planes. We'll do this one and this one. So that's the intersection of the two. Thank you very much.